Good morning. Good morning. This is the day that the Lord has made. Let us rejoice and be glad in it. Amen. 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 Uh, can, I, can I do something? Can, can I do a pew check here? Amen. Has the Lord been good to you? Amen. Has the Lord been good to you? that was made. In him was light, and the life was the light of men. And the light shines in the darkness, and the darkness did not comprehend it. I read to you from the book of John, chapter 1, verses 1 through 5. May the Lord have a blessing to the readers, doers, and hearers of his holy word.
on the way over here today.
Jesus Christ. Amen. And because of that, the blood still works. He made it possible because of the shed blood on the cross of Calvary. Amen.
is still in worship. Yeah, Let us worship in our community. Yeah.
of blessing us to this appointed time. Thank you for healing us through the vicissitudes of life. Thank you for being with us in our ups and in our downs. Thank you, Heavenly Father, that you set a course for our lives. Help us to hold to your unchanging hand. We pray, O oh God, that by the power of the Holy Spirit, you would impact us by the power of your word. Bless us, O oh God. We ask that you would speak so that when your voice is heard, we would be glad and ready to do your every word. It's in Jesus' name that we pray and give thanks. Amen. Just before we go to the word, Usher, you may be seated. Thank you for the young folks who are serving. So good that uh, their parents are raising them Amen. to serve Amen. in the church. Hallelujah. They are the future generation of yes. the church. Yes. And if we don't train our children to love the Lord yes. and walk according to his word, yes. this whole world will be in trouble. Yes. Amen. 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 The majority of the major cities in our country are impacted because of the lack of generational blessings through the church. Yeah. All, right. Yeah. All, right. All right. All right. All right. So we as the church have an obligation to be strong in our faith Amen. Amen. and impact others. Amen. Amen. Um, I wanna, I wanna just offer my sincere thanks to all of you who helped me celebrate my birthday on last week. I appreciate the kind uh, remarks and the gifts and all that you. Uh, blessed me with. Amen. Amen. It, is, it is an encouragement uh, that some don't often get. Amen. Uh, but I just thank each and every one of you. Amen. Let me uh, say thank you to uh, <coughs> Brother Devin. Amen. Devin, Minister Devin Thornton, mm -hmm. has uh, taken our videography <laughs> to another level. level. Amen. And Amen. So we're grateful Thank to you. him and for his work. Amen. Thank you, choir, Amen. for sharing our worship and song. I'm grateful to Reverend Reed. Man, man, man. Even though he preached like he was a crazy man. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> trying to embarrass me. <laughs> but thank you, brother, for sharing the word of God with such power. Amen. I'm, I'm grateful to uh, the Second Baptist Church yeah. family, yeah. Um, yeah. and 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 it is a family. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. Yeah. Amen. And yeah. in families, sometimes there are some difficulties. Right. 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 Mm -hmm. So vying for position. Right. Right. But one thing about families, when it's time to get together. That's right. Families mm -hmm. come together Amen. And, uh, and support one another. Mm -hmm. uh, 
I grew up in a family of seven children. Mm -hmm. and, uh, ain't no way we always all agree. Right. <laughs> always something going on. Right. And, 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 and I'm grateful to my mother and father Amen. and to the Lord God Almighty that he saved us Amen. and Amen. made it clear what his word says Amen. that we are supposed to support one another. Amen. And sometimes you have to support even when you don't understand. <laughs> the thing about families and families working together uh, the enemy doesn't like to see that. Mm -hmm. yeah. No, I don't. Right. The, the, the enemy Lord, help us. will take anything he can yes. and yes. use it to discourage us mm -hmm. and to divide us. Yes. And that's when it's imperative uh -huh. that we hold to God's unchanging Amen. hand. Amen. to his word yeah. Yeah. even when we don't understand right, right, right. what the <laughs> issues are watch out watch out <laughs> in our families <laughs> the devil will make you think that somebody said one thing when they actually said something else <laughs> Yeah. His job is to kill, destroy. steal, destroy. and destroy. Right. And so if he can drop a little bomb, that's true. Issue into <laughs> the organization. He wants to do everything he can yeah. Yeah. to stop the church right. yeah. from being the church. Right. Right. Help. But God designed the Help. church yeah. for a purpose. Yeah. And he has empowered us yeah. 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 to do some things. And if the church was doing what God called and designed it right. to do, right. uh -huh. Uh -huh. He ain't called the church to make millionaires out of the men who stand behind the pulpit. That's right. That's right. That's right. Or billionaires. <laughs> Private jets. Helicopters. Boats. <laughs> I wish that was the case. <laughs> But but it, but it's not. We we are we are called to be the people of God, yeah. 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 and He's yeah. giving us assignments, yeah. Yeah. and He places us together mm -hmm. in the body of Christ, yeah. Yeah. and He empowers us with various gifts. Mm -hmm. Right, right. Mm -hmm. uh, I was. I was going to sing this morning. <laughs> I love to praise him. Yeah. You rang it. Somebody heard you. Somebody that bell. And, and so I wanted, I wanted to praise him. Then, 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 since that song had already been sang, <laughs> I said, "Well, he should be glorified." Yeah. Amen. <laughs> but somebody already stole my thunder. <laughs> so this morning, I want to ring another bell. Listen. Um, in the whole Old Testament, it points to the fact that Jesus is coming. And in the New Testament, it reports Jesus is here. And because Jesus came to the earth and ministered and discipled 
he also left us some instructions. And, and I want to use this morning uh, Romans chapter 1. If you could locate that in your Bible. Romans chapter 1. I want to start reading at verse 8 and read down to verse 17. Romans chapter 1, verse 8. Paul writes these words. First, I thank my God through Jesus Christ for you all that your faith is spoken of throughout the whole world. For God is my witness, whom I serve with my, with my spirit in the gospel of his Son, mm -hmm. that without ceasing I make mention of you always in my prayers, mm -hmm. making request if by some means now at last I may find a way in the will of God to come to you. Mm -hmm. Paul had intended to come to the city of Rome. For I long to see you, that I may impart to you some spiritual gift, so that you may be established. That is, that I may be encouraged together with you by the mutual faith both of you and me. Now, I do not want to be unaware, I don't, do not want you to be unaware, brethren, that I often come to, came to you but have, was hindered until now, that I might have some fruit among you also, just as among other Gentiles. I am a debtor both of Greeks and to barbarians, both wise and unwise, so as much as is in me, I am ready to preach the gospel to you mm -hmm. who are in Rome also. Mm -hmm. Here's our section of scripture for this morning. For I am not ashamed yeah. of the gospel yeah. of Christ. Yeah. For it yeah. is the power of God yeah. to salvation mm -hmm. to, for everyone who believes. Mm -hmm. For the Jew first and also for the Greek. For in it the righteousness of God is revealed through faith to faith. Mm -hmm. As it is written, the just right. shall live yeah. all right, all right. by faith. Yeah. Right. This Amen. is the word of God. You may be seated. Amen. Amen. When Jesus was here on earth, before he left to return to heaven, he gave us the great commandment and the great commission the great commission is God's action plan for the church and for every believer the great commandment is for all who believe the great commandment is that you should love the Lord your God with all your heart, with all your mind, and your soul. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And he says, and the second is like it, that you love one another. Mm -hmm. right. I'm paraphrasing. Right. It's the Ellisonian uh, <laughs> version of the Bible. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and, and, and so he gave us the Great Commission. Mm -hmm. And let me let me let me be clear from the very start. No church can grow without evangelism. Evangelism is bringing the good news of Jesus Christ to those around us who have not heard. Right? The church the church exists to give witness to the gospel. Mm -hmm. This book, this book that we're looking at this morning, written by Paul, is some of Paul's 
greatest writing. Paul uh, introduces the messenger and he introduces the message right. and he introduces his own motive in the first 15 verses of this book. Yes. Paul then turns the spotlight on the gospel that he's, that he's going to be writing about throughout the book. Amen. Y'all go walk with me? Come on, come on. In verses 16 and 17, we are given the greatest summary ever written by man about the gospel because these two in these two verses we can see a clear declaration of the power and purpose of god in the gospel message all right all right mm -hmm, mm -hmm. paul's statement about the gospel begins in a strange a, a, a strange fashion um, so he he comes out of the blue, mm -hmm. seemingly. Mm -hmm. And he tells us that he's not ashamed of the gospel. Mm -hmm. That's a good place to be. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Uh, in our day, this sounds kind of awkward for someone to say they're not ashamed of the gospel. Why should anyone be shamed? Right, right. And uh, it's, it's, it's important that we have some understanding of the culture and that will help us understand why some people in Paul's day might have been ashamed of preaching the gospel message. message. Mm -hmm. uh, there are at least four reasons why some people in Paul's day would have been ashamed of the gospel. First, because of the moral conditions of that day. Um, yeah. Nero was the emperor, and he was a wicked and degenerate man. That's yeah. right. Yeah. And he hated Christians. Mm -hmm. And the city of Rome was a cesspool of sin and wicked living. Mm -hmm. <coughs> the gospel Paul was preaching was diametrically opposed to everything Rome, uh, which was led by Nero, was doing and saying. So it's the, it's the culture that he's living in that would have been uh, 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 important for you to understand uh, why he would say, even though y'all acting a fool, I'm not ashamed of the gospel. Right? And, and, and you know why he wasn't ashamed, don't you? Because he's Paul. <laughs> he used to be Saul. Right, right. Until he ran into Jesus on the Damascus road. And so he has personal experience about what God can do in your life. And when you have personal experience, all right, come on, come on. Come on. The second reason <laughs> Paul was not ashamed, or, or, or it, uh, it would have been difficult for him to say that he was not ashamed yeah. because he was a Jew. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And Jews at that time were considered by many to be subhuman. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I, I, I expected that to, to ring a bell. <laughs> you told me yeah. about yeah. Black History Month. Uh -huh. uh -huh. uh -huh. Man, they were treated as subhuman. Right. Yeah. When we were counted as three Thumb fifths of right. a person. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, 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 uh. The Jews, uh, the culture thought, were fit for nothing but to be despised mistreated and enslaved yeah. mm. traditional jews of that time would have been tempted to shy away from following christ mm -hmm. 
you're helping too much pressure. You're yeah. helping us from the outside. All right, all right. All right, all right. All right. Folks, stop following Christ mm -hmm. because they don't understand. Mm -hmm. What Paul understands right. and what some of us understand mm -hmm. that we had a personal encounter yeah. Yeah. with the living God yeah. Yeah. through the person of Jesus yeah. Christ. Yeah. 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 And when you have an encounter with Jesus, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. it changes mm -hmm. who you are. Yeah. 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 Mm -hmm. It gives you some strength that you didn't even know you yeah. had. Yeah. 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 The key Okay. Uh -huh. yeah. Come on. Mm -hmm. Come on. I was supposed to say this later on, but <laughs> the key is holding uh -huh. to uh -huh. his unchanging uh -huh. hand uh -huh. Uh -huh. in the midst of all your mess. Yes. Right. 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 And especially in the midst of the mess around you. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Everywhere Paul went. Uh -huh. <laughs> They started throwing in jail, whooping, beating, yep. <laughs> leaving for dead. That's where he went. He got in trouble. The third reason it would have been difficult to be ashamed to preach the gospel was because the gospel Paul was preaching was almost unbelievable. Mm. Mm. Uh, the Savior Paul was preaching about was a male member of the despised Jewish race. And he was told, and he was said to be the Savior of all mankind. And he can't claim to be the Son of God. And he even claimed to be God himself. Well, uh, <laughs> this was unbelievable. You have to get back in the culture and the time mm -hmm. to see what things were taking place. Mm -hmm. He claimed to be God himself and at the same time he claimed to be fully man. Uh -huh. uh, his death on the cross <clears throat> was different than any other man. He died on the cross, which was a symbol of shame. But in dying, he was said to have died for everybody. Uh -huh. Unbelievable. <laughs> and if that wasn't enough, he was said to have risen from the dead yeah. on the third day yeah. after his death. Uh -huh. yeah. Yeah. Too many people. <laughs> the claims of the gospel were just too bizarre to believe. Yeah. And that's still true today. Yeah. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Yeah. People here about this Jesus yeah, and how he rose from the dead uh. and that's just too incredible for them to believe right. Right. that that means that means uh, some witnesses uh -huh. <laughs> need to take the stand uh -huh. Uh -huh. Yeah. Mm -hmm. and no matter how incredible and perhaps even incredulous, your story may be. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's your testimony. Amen. 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 And you hold Amen. on to Amen. your testimony. Yeah. Your yeah. testimony may not be for everybody. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Right. He may have had yeah. you go through what you went through so you could testify to just one yeah. person. Yeah. Uh -huh. And who yes, knows Lord. who that one person <laughs> may become. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. You don't know what God's plan is. Yeah. Yeah. All right. All right. Yeah. Thank you, yeah. Lord. Yeah. All right. The fourth reason yeah. it's strange that Paul would say, I'm not ashamed of the gospel. Right. Uh -huh. Amen. Because Everywhere Paul went, preaching the cross, the cross, he was 
ridicule, mm -hmm. yeah. cast out, yeah. in yeah. prison, in prison uh -huh. and treated cruelly. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Many would not have been able to endure mm -hmm. the shame of the cross yeah. at that time. Right. But listen to me real good. Whatever it is that God has called you to do, yeah. no matter what, Man. Those around you yeah. <clears throat> may think about it. That's right. You keep doing what God has called you to do. Yeah. Yeah. Stay with it. Right. Yeah. Don't quit. Right. Don't give up. Right. Hallelujah, Right. So with all these things in mind, <clears throat> it's easy to see why Paul would want to be clear uh -huh. about his commitment to the gospel. Right. Uh -huh. And listen, I, 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 want, I, want, I want to make it clear. Uh, uh, I want my commitment to the gospel to be the same extent. Amen. 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 Now, 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 now. It's easy to say amen. But it is serious business yes. when you make that commitment. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And the reason it's serious business is because you place a high, a, a, you become a high profile profile target right. for the devil. Yes, right. 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 Mm -hmm. yes, right. mm -hmm. yeah. He knows yes, sir. Uh -huh. yes, sir. Yeah. Yeah. when you're having an impact yes, right. on bringing people out of his kingdom right. yeah. mm -hmm. into the uh -huh. kingdom of God. And so in, in, in this same book no, not, not in this book. <laughs> I'm sorry. In the book of Ephesians, uh -huh. Paul tells us to put on the whole armor of God. In other words, <laughs> you're going to make your commitment to the gospel. <laughs> You better be ready for some warfare. Right. Right. Amen. Right. Amen. And listen, and listen. Help us, Lord. Huh? It's kind of like that, that, that scary movie. When someone called and the girl picked up the phone. When that stranger calls. <laughs> and they said all the calls are coming from in the house. Yeah. <laughs> Listen, I'm telling you this. No matter what things take place, sometimes yeah. the calls yeah. are coming. So, so, uh-huh. <laughs> I, 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 I want to say some more, but y'all ain't ready. Preach! Preach it! Preach it! Preach it! Preach it! Preach it! Preach it! At this point, I, allow me to point out five things. Um, why we should share the gospel. Because of all the threats yeah. to the gospel. Right. Yeah. Mm -hmm. When you become a disciple of right. I'm talking about a show enough disciple right. of right. Jesus Christ right. sometimes the calls are coming from within the house right. yeah. Yeah. <laughs> please understand I'm not talking about other folks around right. <laughs> I'm talking about the calls are coming from inside the house All right. Look, 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 look. It, 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 the devil been around a long time. He knows all the tricks and traps that he can throw at people. Listen, listen, listen. The good news is 
he's still throwing that same old curveball. <laughs> 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 The bad news is you still falling for it. People still falling for it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Forever. Yeah, right, right. The names may change. That's right. <laughs> but the results are still the same. Right. And you have to be Christian enough mm. to say fool me once. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Twice. Uh -huh. For us yeah. as believers. Mm -hmm. There are reasons in the book yeah. for us not to be ashamed. Mm -hmm. That's right. And there are reasons for us to share the gospel. Right. Can yeah. I share them with you? Right. Come, on. Come on. Five things I want to point out. Take your time. Take your time. Mm -hmm. If it gets too late, I can, you know. Take me your time. Number one. Is the power mm -hmm. of the gospel. Yeah. 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 There's power in the word of God. Yes, 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 yes. And number two, the purpose of the gospel. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And number three, the plan of the gospel. Mm -hmm. Number four, the pledge of the gospel. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And lastly, but certainly not least, the product of the gospel. Yeah. The power, the purpose, the plan, the pledge, and the product. Mm -hmm. uh, first, the power of the gospel. Mm -hmm. It's right there in verse 16. For I am not ashamed of the gospel of Christ, yeah. for it is the power of God. Mm -hmm. It's God's power. Paul tells us that he's not ashamed of the gospel because it's the power of God. Yeah. Whenever we preach the gospel, it's the power of God being announced. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. We're declaring the power of God to save sinners unto salvation. Yeah. The word here, power, refers to might, energy, force, strength, that dwells within God. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. It is the very energy of, of the life of God himself. It is supernatural in the energy that emanates from God's being. Y'all remember when Moses went up to the hill and got in the presence of God and yeah. came back down and scared the <laughs> fright. Yeah. Out of all the people. Yeah. Because his face was glowing. Right, right. Because he yeah. had been in yeah. the presence yeah. of God. Yeah. Uh, yeah. The, 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 the thing about God's power is he could have revealed his power against sin in any way he chose. Yeah. yeah. He could have wiped out all mankind from the face of the earth. Yeah. Right, right. He could have done anything he wanted because he is the all powerful God. Yeah. Uh -huh. Amen. Amen. Therefore, it's a blessing to notice that when the Lord moved to do something about sin, he extra he exercised his power by sending his son right. by grace. Yeah. 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 Mm -hmm. Not because of anything that's in you, me, right. or anybody else, oh, right. but it right. was right. simply right. his yeah. grace. That's right. He did Amen. what Amen. he wanted to. Yeah. There's nothing in you that makes you worthy. He just did it because yeah. he is God of love. Yeah. 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 Thank you, Lord. He could have sent us all to hell. Right, mm -hmm. right. But instead he chose to send us his love 
wrapped up in his son. Yes. Yes. The Lord Jesus yes. Christ. Yes. Thank you, Lord. I thank, thank the Lord you. that he loved me enough yes. to use his power to save me yes. and all believers. Thank you, Lord. Notice that Paul's message is the gospel of Christ. That's what his message reveals. Make no mistake about it. There are many different gospels Preach, being preached today. Yes. Just as it, as it was in Paul's day. Mm -hmm. But you can only find the true gospel yes. in the word of God. Yes. Yes. The only true gospel is the good news about Jesus oh, Christ. Man, man. Oh, the coming of Christ to show the power of the gospel yes. is Proved by the resurrection of Jesus, uh -huh. showing that he conquered death, hell, and the grave. Yeah. Yeah. That's the power the news of the yeah. gospel. Yeah. 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 And we, 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 should, we should be willing yes. to share that power yeah. Yeah. with yeah. others. Yeah. Right. Help us now. Yeah. So, so, so point number one, the, the power of the gospel. Point number two, the purpose of the gospel. Let me see if I can find it in my Bible. Maybe it's in yours too. <laughs> it is the power of God for salvation for everyone who believes. It's the power of God unto salvation for everyone who believes. Now listen. And we're thinking about this logically. We should ask ourselves, why did God go to such lengths to save us? Why did he go give up his son to die on a cross for the sins of humanity? The primary answer is because he loves us. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank, Thank you, Lord. Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. However, Thank you. Thank you, Lord. there's more to that. There's more to, to it than just that. Yes. God's plan and purpose is giving the gospel and giving the gospel message is salvation. Mm -hmm. So that we could be saved from the eternal hell. Yeah. The gospel is the power of God. Amen. The word salvation is a very important word. It means safety, pers pers preservation, deliverance. It carries the idea of being rescued mm -hmm. from all harm yeah. and danger. Man. Yeah. Man. Listen, the reason you want to receive the gospel is the same reason you should want to share the gospel. Right. You want to be preserved from all hurt, harm, and danger, yeah. eternal death, damnation, in the hell fires, and you should want the person sitting next to you mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Right. Man. to experience the same thing. Yeah. 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 God's purpose in, giving sin in, in saving sinners is to deliver them from spiritual death. Spiritual defilement, spiritual deception, and spiritual destruction. All right, all right. We should never forget that the end of all people outside of a life in Jesus Christ mm -hmm. is damnation in the eternal fires of hell. Mm -hmm. Listen, listen, don't, 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 don't push that back to the back of your right, mind. Right, right, that's right. That's right. You don't want to see anybody go to hell. Right, right, right. Amen. Man. Making a point. Preach. Sometimes you may think <laughs> that there's a couple fellas <laughs> Nobody. Usually they have orange hair, but that's a different story. <laughs> I'm grateful to the Lord that he gave us salvation that we do not have to worry about. 
Yeah. Once we receive Jesus Christ as our Lord and yeah. Savior, yeah. we don't have to worry about our salvation. Yeah. The enemy will try to make us wonder if we really saved. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, come on, y'all. Yeah. Tell the truth. Yeah. Right. Save the devil. Yeah. Yeah. He, 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 he'll work on you. Yeah. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Put thoughts in your mind. Right, yes. Yes. Mm -hmm. Try to drag you down. Yes, sir. Yeah. Sure will. Mm. <laughs> it's good. Uh, so our salvation is, is good for us as long as God lives. Amen. Right. And we live in Him. Right. Uh -huh. And His purpose is a part of this plan. Listen, listen, listen. God controls everything. Everything. Yeah. When we put our trust in Him, uh -huh. we're good. Amen. Thank you. Come hell or high water. That's right. Come COVID. <laughs> Amen. Amen. Come slavery. Yeah. Uh -huh. Amen. Come racism. Yes. Come beat down. Right. Yeah. We are good. Right. <clears throat> because we only down here on the ground for a little while. Right. Right. Oh, sir. And everybody got to get up and go somewhere. Right. Yeah. Right. There's only two destinations. Right. You're going to live in eternity with God, or are you going to live in heaven? I mean, in hell without him. That's right. That's right. Uh-huh. <clears throat> so it, 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 it's the power of God. Yeah. And it's the purpose of God. Right. Mm -hmm. And then number three, it's the plan of God. Yeah. Yeah. Verse 16 tells us in no uncertain terms exactly how this gospel message of salvation is activated. Mm -hmm. Notice in that verse, it says, to everyone that believes. That's God's plan. Right. Yeah. For you to believe the gospel message, accept Jesus Christ as your Savior, and live as a disciple. Right, yeah. It makes perfectly clear that biblical salvation does not involve complicated re, uh, religious rituals or ornate elaborate religious exercises salvation is the product of faith alone mm -hmm. and, 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 and my bible tells me that faith is a gift of God Amen. Amen. <laughs> we can't have faith without him Amen. Mm -hmm. that's his plan for us to believe what's in this book. Mm -hmm. and, 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 and unfortunately, this idea of living by faith is the point where many people stumble. Mm -hmm. People, human beings, like to do things for themselves. Mm -hmm. They like to feel that they have a part of everything in their lives. Oh, yeah. <laughs> However, mm. In the matter of salvation, the sinner can have no part. Amen. Right? Teach me. It's all of God all the way. Preach, right. preach. Salvation comes to the person who is simply willing to receive the message of Christ by faith. Mm -hmm. You can't do nothing <laughs> to gain your salvation. Right. You could fall on the floor and flop around. You could run circles around the building. You could flap your wings. You could laugh, <laughs> scream, cry, and crawl. None of that hmm. is going to make a difference. <laughs> I'm thankful to the Lord. Yeah, yeah. That He kept His salvation through the gospel. Inexpensive. 
Amen. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> and easy to understand. Right. <laughs> Some things just cost too much. Right. Mm -hmm. It's nice to have some of that stuff. But it costs mm -hmm. too much. And then some things are just hard to understand. I, 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 I don't understand all this stuff about genomes and all the scientific jargon and language and it's good to know that I don't have to understand those things. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. All yeah, I yeah. have to understand that he died All right. yeah. for me. All right. yeah. Yeah. I can understand that. We can get wrapped up in theological terms and we can talk about all of the things that are in the Bible and we can read long sections of writings uh -huh. right. that describe and uh, 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 talk about uh, all of the theological matters in the world. But I'm glad uh -huh. I don't have to understand all of those things. Amen. Uh -huh. Can I tell you a secret? When I was in school, I never liked taking tests. Yeah. <laughs> I thought it was good enough that I was in the class. <laughs> I heard what you said, <laughs> leaving it at that. <laughs> so I'm glad, I'm glad that uh -huh. that, that, that salvation is inexpensive right. and easy to understand. Right. Right. My question for you today is this. What are you trusting in? Mm. What are you trusting in today? Mm. Are, are, are you, listen, I know it's Sunday morning. <laughs> We're at church. It's easy to feel like, well, I'm trusting in the Lord. <laughs> Because I'm here. Mm -hmm. Oh, sir. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. But listen, you you have to have a personal encounter yeah. with Him yeah. Yeah. to change your life. Mm -hmm. Coming in this building don't mm -hmm. mean yeah. mm -hmm. That's right. <laughs> Italy. It doesn't mean that you're saved mm -hmm. automatically. Mm -hmm. So you have to know. For yourself, mm -hmm. what you are trusting in, yeah, yeah, and the be best way, the only way, is to know what the Lord said in the book mm -hmm. and be at a Bible teaching, Bible believing church. Amen. Right? Amen. 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 Uh, the power of God, the purpose of God, the plan of God. And then the product of the gospel. Did I do that wrong? That was four. Uh, the of the gospel. Uh, this one. I'm just testing to see if you can see it. Good answer. The plan of the gospel. This great saving gospel message is for every single person in the world. Yeah. No one is beyond the reach of the gospel of grace. Uh -huh. Notice the words of our Savior, Revelation 22, 17. Let me see if I can find it. Revelation 22, 17 says, And the Spirit and the bride say, Come, and let him who thirsts come. Whoever desires, let him take the water of life uh -huh. freely. Uh -huh. Listen, it, 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 it's for everybody. Yeah. I'm trying to tell you. Um, uh, and then look, look what he says in John uh, 6, uh, 37. All that the Father gave me will come to me, and the one who comes to me, I will by no means put him out. <laughs> 
That's good news about the pledge of the gospel. He says that if you receive him uh, and the gospel, he will not put you out. The pledge of the gospel is that anyone who hears the message and needs the cure can be saved by God's precious grace. Amen. 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 Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Mm -hmm. you, 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 you don't have to have Thank you, Lord. anything else. Many have labored over the term to the Jew first and also to the Greek. Listen, that shouldn't bother us. God didn't give the gospel to the Jew first in reference to priority. Mm -hmm. But that's what some Preach. folks mm -hmm. want you to believe. Right, right. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they were the chosen people, but they were chosen first. Right. He gave the gospel to the Jew first right. in reference to time. All right, mm -hmm. all right, all right. Mm -hmm. all right. He's giving the gospel to people. Yeah. He gave his word to the Jews first. Yeah. Amen. Right. All right, y'all know what happened. <laughs> In the Old Testament, it was about Jesus is coming. Yeah, that's what they were hearing. That's what they were believing. Mm -hmm. The New Testament, Jesus is here. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. Yeah. Swing and a miss <laughs> because they didn't see that Jesus Christ was the one who the Old Testament was talking about. Right. 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 Uh -huh. Far as I know, in, in my limited understanding, they still waiting for the Messiah. Uh -huh. <laughs> help, 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 help. Uh -huh. The issue is, God had been dealing with the Jewish people for thousands of years. And when he sent his son into the world to be Messiah of the Jewish people, mm -hmm. John 11 says they, they rejected him. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Then the Lord turned to the Gentile people to offer salvation uh -huh. to them, yeah. as John uh -huh. 1 12. Mm -hmm. Therefore, salvation now is available to every person on the face of the earth. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The issue is, will you receive it? Yeah. Or not? When you when you receive it, you would have the power to share it. Amen. 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 These verses, verses make it clear that salvation is for anyone, mm -hmm. regardless of their race, mm -hmm. social standing, their education, their ability, or even their level of wickedness. Mm -hmm. There's nothing which can prevent anyone who wants to be saved from being saved. Right. Right. The pledge of the gospel is for per, uh, for uh, <coughs> mankind everywhere, and 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 I thank God that is so. Uh -huh. No matter where you are, what your situation, right. you have the pledge of the gospel. Yeah. Mm -hmm. If you receive Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior, you will. Be saved. All right. Amen. 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 Listen, that's, that, 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 that's why uh, sharing the gospel is so important. Yeah. We, we need to know what it is. Mm -hmm. And then we need to share it. Mm -hmm. So lastly, the product of the gospel. Is that number five? Uh -huh. yes. mm -hmm. Y'all keep me straight now. <laughs> the product of the gospel in the life of the believer is righteousness. Mm -hmm. But mankind has two great problems. Right. Hmm. The first time, the first problem is 
he thinks he's already righteous and therefore acceptable to the Lord. Mm. Mm. Wow. Whether he whether he accepted Jesus or not. Yeah. Yeah. Y'all right, right. Preaching. Come on, come on. act like you preaching. Because I'm who I am, I'm good enough to be righteous. Look, 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 look. I don't sick my dog with the mailman. I pay my taxes. <laughs> Keep up the good work. That's it. That, that's it. That's that's problem number one. And watch this. Problem number two is that he's absolutely wrong about problem number one. Man is. Not righteous and cannot produce righteousness by his own self will yeah. Yeah. or his own good works. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. However, when faith is placed in the gospel message and Jesus is believed as Savior, God takes the sinner and declares him or her righteous. Yeah. What man cannot do by self-effort, God can do by his saving power. Mm -hmm. right? That's the product of the gospel. Yeah. Yeah. Simply stated, everything man looks for in religion, uh, peace with God, acceptance by God, and a right relationship with God are all given to the believer when he or she receives the gospel message yeah. all right, all right. Yeah. by faith yeah. Yeah. in yeah. Jesus Christ. Yeah. 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 And, and listen, listen. That's a message worth say, sharing. Yeah. Yeah. That's why Jesus said to all of his followers, Go therefore and make disciples of all nations. Yeah. Yeah. If yeah. you're a Christian, you need a Bible believing, Bible teaching church yeah. to help you grow and be yeah. transformed yeah. by the Word of God. Yeah. Yeah. Right? Yeah. When you are transformed yeah. by the Word of God, yeah. there'll be something in you that will want you, that, that will make you want to share uh -huh. with people around you. Yeah. Yeah. Now listen, yeah. listen, listen. Sharing with people around you does not mean making somebody a Christian. Amen. Right. Amen. Right. Amen. You share your testimony yes, and it's right. up to them yes, yes, yeah. to right. accept it. Right. Yes. Right. And then when they don't accept your testimony, you show them that why you believe it is because it's in a love letter that God wrote to you. Yeah. 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 Amen. Uh -huh. And don't let nobody tell you Oh yeah, that's that's just a book. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's, it's been changed. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You know, the original one was written by aliens from outer space. <laughs> <laughs> Please don't 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 let that mess stress you. Uh -huh. mm. It's been proven over and over. Amen. Thank you, Lord. The Bible. It's true. Amen. 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 Thank you, Lord. If you are here today and you're already saved, mm -hmm. Jesus asked you on a personal level mm -hmm. to make more disciples by sharing the good news. Amen. Amen. Now listen, <clears throat> at this church, as long as the Lord allows me to be in charge, mm -hmm. we are going to share the good news Amen. of Jesus Christ. Amen. 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 And listen, that doesn't mean everybody has to be a Bible scholar. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Amen. You just need to know what we learned in Sunday school. Uh -huh. Thank you, Lord. Mary had <laughs> and his name was Jesus Christ. You, you, you share what you know to be true from the Word of God. Yes. 
and it's up to the person who hears mm -hmm. to receive it. Amen. Mm -hmm. But yeah. it's your responsibility yeah. to, to share it. Yeah. Amen. Amen. So all of us have the assignment mm -hmm. to share the good news right. with yeah. others. Amen. Mm -hmm. Now listen, <clears throat> at this church, we will not leave you hanging. Mm -hmm. Amen. We, 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 we're going to do uh, some training on how to share the good news. Amen. All right. The, the, the thing about evangelism and sharing the good news, some people can tell you three kinds of evangelism, mm -hmm. but others can tell you as many as eight. Mm -hmm. We're going to uh, go through. Uh, those three and those eight mm -hmm. so that anybody who wants to learn how to share the good news mm -hmm. right we'll train you mm -hmm. listen listen uh, I'm asking my preachers to get ready mm -hmm. we, we, we're going to open up more training for people in various areas of ministry. Amen. I, I'm asking all the leaders to make sure that whatever you're doing in your ministry, that you let me know first. Amen. I don't want to be caught off guard. Amen. <laughs> Somebody asked me a question, I don't know. I don't know, I just preach here. <laughs> I want to know the direction we're going in every area of ministry. Amen. Amen. And I, I I'm not even want to know what songs we're going to sing on Sunday. Amen. So I don't plan on singing the same song. <laughs> I have no idea why you folks Start laughing every time I talk about singing. <laughs> Give us a sample. Sing it. <laughs> if you are here, <laughs> you have not received Christ as your Savior, we invite you Amen. to do Amen. so Amen. now. Amen. Amen. To receive Christ as your Savior today. Amen. Yeah. If, if, if that's your desire and you're here in the sanctuary, you can come forward now <coughs> and then we'll give you further instructions. If you're watching virtually, you can contact us at our website or call us at our phone number and we'll be glad to assist you with your next steps. We'll even make a pledge to help you find a church in your area. Amen. It's as simple as Romans 10 and 9. You confess with your mouth and believe in your heart that God raised Jesus from the dead then you shall be saved. If you make that decision, please give us a call so we can help you with your next directions. Amen. 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 Let's pray. Father in heaven, we thank you for your word and your instructions to us. Help us, oh God, to be obedient to your command for us to go and make disciples. I thank you, Heavenly Father, for these, your children of the Second Baptist Church family. I pray for those who are watching virtually. I ask that you would bless us, guide us, and direct us according to your perfect will. In Jesus' name. We pray and give thanks. Amen. 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 God bless you. We're going to do uh, uh, the benediction now, then we'll um, share communion. Amen. Amen. If you just stand with me. Uh, receive the benediction. Father in heaven, we thank you so much you. for sending your darling son, Jesus Christ, to save us 
from eternal damnation. Thank you. We thank you, Heavenly Father, for being God and God all by yourself. Yes. Now unto him who is able to present us faultless before the very throne of grace to the only wise God, be glory, power, and dominion, both now, henceforth, and forevermore. And all the people sang together. Amen. 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 Amen.